Hello again. Here it is as promised. Um, my 10 cent book sale from the library. This is probably the book that I was most excited to find um, because it would make a, an amazing Alice in Wonderland journal. And you will see why. A second. Smell. No. Oh, I thought I'd be able to just slip this out like you normally can, but it doesn't. Oh yeah, here we go. Okay, look at the cover. It's cards. Silver cards. Isn't that fun? Decent size. So there, I thought that would make a really great Alice in Wonderland. I hope this, mm, well, a little bit of mark left there by the tape. But I'm sure I can work around that, right? There's that. So I find that 10 cents, ladies and gentlemen. And I grab this because I'm a sucker for anything Disney. There's Tarzan. It's a big book and it's got really nice. They almost look like paintings of this story. I love this movie. My son was small when it came out at the movies. Of we had, oh, and then we bought the video, and then we bought the soundtrack, and yeah, we loved it. So there's that. This has some really nice pictures of quilts in it. Better Homes and Gardens Creative American Quilting. And let's see. 1989. Look at this page alone. Got all the nice stuff on there you could use in a journal. With the little squares. And there's big pictures. There's the big, and then they have these, which are fun. Um, let's see. Yeah, there's a big picture. Quilt. You could put in a junk journal. And there's quite a few of those throughout the book, so I thought those were great. There's that. And then Carolyn Ambuters. Sorry about the glare. Needlepoint Celebrations. This also has very nice. And let me tell you, there were hundreds of books. I ended up putting some back. 1976, this book is from. I ended up buying, I think, 11 books. Yeah, because I paid a dollar ten. Look at this. It's all the months of the year. Every single month has one of these and one of these. It's November, October, September. Yeah, I'm pretty. <laughs> I'm pretty happy with this. This is pretty nice. I mean, look at the gra look at the pictures in this book. Look at that. That's all the. It's just so cool. I mean, wow. If anybody comes across one of these, snatch it up because it's got some great stuff in it. Carolyn Ambuters or Ambuters, I don't know. Needlepoint Celebrations. Grab it, people. Then I grab this stamp collecting as a hobby. It's got all kinds of pictures of stamps. You can cut out. I can color them. I can cut them out. I can make and embellish. All sorts of wonderful things with all these. Look at there's cats. Australia, UK, airport. I mean, Great pictures in there. This I bought because I was kind of curious about um, head vases. I say vases in uh, upstate New York. We say vases. I don't know what people say in other parts of the country. I think they say vases. But we say vases here. And look at the cute. I mean, how, just how cute are these pictures? Just 
all different. Just love it. Look at the little, look at the babies. It's just so cute. Be fun to cut up. Um, everything flowers, quilts from the garden. This has some really nice stuff in it too. Look at that. That'd make a beautiful bookmark right there. And uh, I don't see the year. It's got to be here. Hmm. I don't see it. Do you see it, people? I don't know. I don't see it. Anyway, I don't know. Really pretty quilt images and live images. Super pretty. So yeah, there's that. So that'll be fun to cut up too. And I love this book. <laughs> I just love this book. This book is like my Bible right here. I love jewelry and I love uh, vintage rhinestone. You know, the stuff you find at flea markets and rummage sales and garage sales. And I mean, some of this stuff is like really nice. And if you found it at a yard sale, you'd be pretty excited. But it's really great images in here. And I think it would be kind of cool to put like a picture like that, you fussy cut it out and you put it on the front of a journal and it looks like you have a actual brooch on the front of your journal. So that'd be kind of neat to do. And there's just bracelets and, oh, just love it. Love it. Oh. So I have yet to really look through it because you never know. I might have some of this stuff. I have a lot of vintage jewelry. Look at that. Oh, who wouldn't love to have that? Look at that. Mm, love it. Um, this is a pretty good one too. Design and print your own posters. I have another design and print your own poster um, book, but it's older. This one's kind of more recent. It's got some great um, stuff to cut out and put in a junk journal. 1976, J.I. Beagle, Beagle, Beagle Lyson. Hey. It's got all kinds of alphabets. Yeah. Alphabets and you can mix and match, spell some cool words. It's got, let me see, there's some cool pages. These are kind of boring. Come on, give me a cool page. Graphics, the colors. Let's see, what do we got here? I mean, look at that. And there's all of these images. The months of the year. All the holidays, babies, leprechauns, and they're, you know, they're vintage. They're from, what did I say, 76? So I think I'm going to have a lot of fun with that. Yeah. There's that. And then I bought two books with, I'm sure you guys have seen these. Oh, this one isn't as great. It's got modern paintings in it. Let me see what am I in the frame here. I also like the cover. To make a journal with. Concise history of modern painting. This one's okay, but the next one's even nicer. The cover's nicer too. This is green. Green's my favorite color. I love green. My birthstone is emerald. I'm a May baby. Love it. Concise history of painting from Jado to Cezanne. Look at this 
has. Yeah, this has got way nicer pictures in it. Way nicer pictures. And I will. Oh, there's Venus. Birth of Venus. <clears throat> and I will cut this part. I have no qualms. I'll cut it right out. So yeah, 10 cents. 10 cents each for those books. A dollar ten for all that. I think they look fun. And uh, like I said, I put a lot back. Because <laughs> I didn't want to have to haul it into my house. And probably my husband would say, oh my god, you bought more books. So I didn't buy a ton. 11. I think that's reasonable. 11 books. Not too bad. So anyway, there's my haul from the library. And I still have one more haul to do of free books that were out by the Humane Society. Um, and I went there with my sister and I found some really nice ones. So I will be doing that one. And um, yeah, maybe tonight, maybe soon. I'll be talking to you soon. Thanks. Bye.